701. The Minot Aircraft Modelers will host a two-day open house beginning tomorrow, and Carmel chats with two of the organizers all about it. Hi guys, joining me in the studio. I am accompanied by these marvelous aircrafts, and also I have Steve and George with the Minot Aircraft Modelers. Thank you for joining me, fellas. <laughs> My You're pleasure. Welcome. Thank you. Absolutely. Yeah. So you guys are having a huge open house. Tell us about that. Okay, the reason we're having the open house is to encourage people to come out and enjoy our beautiful scenery out there and see an air show and meet some new people and maybe even create a new hobby. We have an excellent facility out there and it's just a perfect uh, time to get the whole family out. We have a jungle gym for the kids to play in. We've got concession stands. We've got an RV park where you can bring your camper and spend a whole weekend if you like. Wow. Steve and I were talking earlier, and this is not only for people who are like experts in models. Yeah, modern airplanes like this one here that's made of styrofoam mm -hmm. uh, it also comes with a, a gyro package that stabilizes the aircraft in flight. So even a beginner on their first day out, we've had guys come out with a brand new airplane, their first time never flown before, and they take off and circle and land uh, like a pro. How it's amazing. Beautiful. Yeah. So these two model airplanes, they're two different kinds, That's and one actually runs on gas. Right. That's the one I brought. Yes. It's called a Twister. It's got super large uh, airfoil and uh, control surfaces, so you can do stunts with it. But it also flies very slow and easy for a beginner who could, wants to do a gas model airplane. And the gas is a mixture of nitromethane and oils and different things, and it's kind of pricey, but uh, a lot of us like the old motor sound. Mm -hmm. You know, you have that real two-cycle motor sound. This one here is, is, is a F2G Corsair, modeled after a full-scale one, uh, obviously. It's more of a sport model scale plane, like I said, designed and, and flown to look like a race airplane from Reno Air Races. There's been several models out there, but um, this is the one we've got in our club. And it runs about, I'd say about 60 mile an hour. And it runs off a of battery rather than fuel. Right. Yeah. I do want to touch on your facility one more time because you guys have a hangar there as well. Yeah, the hangar, I call it the clubhouse because it's a multi-purpose building. We have room to store our models so we don't have to drag them back and forth every, every time we come out. We've got picnic tables in there we use for eating and for uh, our club meetings and stuff. And we have workbenches for you to repair your airplane and whatever, and stuff like that. For our viewers out there who are interested, how can they join the club? Come on out to the uh, open house that day and talk to either George or I and, or anybody that looks like they might be a flyer. And uh, we'll set you up with a, a membership, which is 50 bucks a year annual. And we also require that you would uh, be a member of our national um, chain, which would be the Academy of Model Aeronautics. Yeah, and you can get more information by stopping by the Aeroport Hobby Shop right outside the airport there on Broadway and talk to Clint. He'll brief you on everything you need to know about joining the club. Or you can go to our website uh, at mindedaircraftmodelers.com and uh, there's an application there you can download. And we also have a Facebook page. So give us the information about the open house one more time, the date and time. It's going to be on Saturday the 24th, same day as the... Uh, the fair parade and it'll also be on the 25th and it'll be from 11 to 4 and at, uh, from 2 to 4 we'll have a training session where you can actually um, fly an airplane. How cool! Yeah. Yeah. Don't miss your chance to fly a model airplane. I definitely want to try to fly one but I'm too nervous I don't want to break anything. <laughs> so bring your picnic basket and your lawn chairs and see you there. See you guys there. All right. Don't forget the lawn chairs. That's always important. And the picnic basket. But the two-day open house will take place Saturday and Sunday from 11 until 4 at the Minot Aircraft Modelers Field. Looks like a lot of fun. Coming up next, Marlo, he's going to let us know what we should celebrate on today's National Day calendar. And we'll let you know the latest happening in entertainment news.